Yo guys, what is up? It's Teach here, coming at you again with another video over on Genesis. We are on my personal server cluster right now. I'll leave a link below in case you'd like to come join. But I want to show you a really awesome trick over on Genesis that is like shockingly easy and that just makes something really overpowering actually. So the mech. Now if you are inside of a mech and you have the Siege Cannon module attacked, you can actually tame a crazy amount of space whales. I know that might seem a little bit weird, um, but that's kind of just how it is. And in order to find the space whales, my best spot, you can see just a ton of them in this area, um, is right over here in this zone, and I'll show you the map real quick. Oh, I can't show you the map while I'm inside this thing, but you can see them all over the place. So. I don't know why they tend to spawn near these like green things, but they do. I do not know why. But this is about the easiest way you can possibly tame them, just in general. Um, use the mech because the mech will get you where you need to go. And it'll be really easy. You just have to find a good little pillar to stand on so you can actually get into a reasonable range for these guys. And uh, getting them is shockingly easy. Now, you do have to pull them to you, which can be the biggest pain in the butt part, but um, it, is, it is definitely doable, uh, just so you know. Let's see if I can actually get one to come to me here. Might be out of my distance. Yeah, it's too far away. Okay. So basically, siege cannon on, pull them to you, and then when they come to you, shoot them in the head, and you can pretty much instantaneously knock these out with almost any mech. All right. Unfortunately, this one has decided that it needs to, uh... Oh, really? Hmm. That was actually pretty low to the ground. Maybe I'll try and tame it with the ground purpose here. So we just have to get its attention. And then, boom, shock a lock, we win. Alright. I might even be able to use the mech gun here. Why is it going so low? Alright, really, my dude? Uh oh, he just like TP'd up high. Okay, so I'm gonna have to actually get off and fight these things. Where'd it go? There we go. So I gotta get the whale's attention now. There we go. So I gotta get out of here. And just so you guys can see, that is literally as fast as it goes right there. You just use the siege cannon, pull it to you, and these things go night night. Check it out. I mean, that's that's a little bit OP. I'll tame a couple more just so I can show you real quick. But man, that's uh, that's all you gotta do. All right, and we have one coming down here. We're all prepped, ready to go. Got its attention. that first shot and is that enough is it just one shot wow okay now let's go ahead and check this guy just to make sure yep that's a level 180 astrocetus right there that just got knocked out so there you go so let's go ahead and do a couple more just to show you that this is working and this is on my solar or i guess cluster series here you can see that there and uh, we gotta find ourselves another whale. So this, again, is the area where I tend to find them, but it's up to you. All right, I know there were a couple around here. Where, oh, where are the whaley whaleys at? Sometimes they're just out of your range because they're up high. Okay, let's see here. Whales, whales. Oh, there's one up there. I just gotta get his attention. Come here, big guy. Huh. Someone's running around. On a tech suit. Okay, so there's a space whale. Just gotta get to him. Oh, there's another one over there. 
He, this one's moving fast. My goodness. He's going to drop. He might be down at my level. Yes. Come here. Is that another one shot? Oh my goodness. Look at that. So. Literally. That's all you got to do. Another one. Let's see if I can get another one over here. As you can see, these guys in my server are trying to figure out what I'm doing, but I'm doing it. All right, come on, big guy. You can do this. I have faith in you. There we go. So we've got to get up to this guy in order to actually... What the heck? I hate these things so much. Drones are such a pain in the butt. All right, let's go ahead and bring it. I'll bring you guys back once I get it down a little further. All right, so we have one more. There's aggro to us currently, and uh, it looks like we're gonna have a shot at him. He's gonna like go past us here. Oh, I missed. Oh, this is bad. He's too close. I missed on that one. That might hit him. What? I'm like missing by massive amounts here. What am I doing wrong? Can you not aim that high or something? Hmm. Interesting. So, I've got to get a magger to me again. Oh well, you get the point. I can easily knock them out. Ooh, is that another whale over there? That might be better. Yeah, that one's running for me. He must be almost narked. Okay, so this one on the other hand is not almost knocked out. Now again, Bloodstalker is how I would do this if I was you. How is he up so high? So this is how I would do it solo, but I mean obviously if I was you, Bloodstalker with a teammate, and that is how I would do this. How high up is this thing? Come on. But have your mech waiting down beneath, and you should be able to easily knock these out. Come on. Come on. There we go. Now he's gonna follow me down. I need to kind of like directionally place myself down to the ground here. He'll follow me pretty much the entire way down. And if you have your Bloodstalker, you can kind of like float your way down and jump your way up. That's how I would do this. Obviously, I have a tech suit, so that makes it a little bit different. Every now and then, just make sure you keep his attention on you. It looks like my mech is over here. Yeah, that's where it is. Ow. Did that thing really not die? Okay, so the Astrocetus is very, very, very fast. My goodness, okay. So, we gotta get into the mech. No pressure, right? And where'd the Astrocetus? There it is. I think that's a one-shot. Oh, I blew myself up. Worth it. So, be careful about uh, damage you take to yourself, clearly, but it's worth it because you knock them out. So anyways, if you're uh, having troubles taming some Astrocetus, this is how you do it solo. Grab yourself a mech, it's well worth it, because everything tech is super easy over on Genesis, so not, not a big issue at all. And then you can kind of just land on their body and feed them. So anyways, hope this video helps you out, and teach out.